So a while ago, me and Soul Reaper here actually did a aerial refueling video for the channel where we used a system to create actual working fuel in this game for our vehicles. However, that system is a bit outdated. It used pistons and distance sensors and was somewhat unreliable. But with the early access to 1.9 with the new logic blocks, that is exactly what we're doing today. And that's revisiting that whole system because we've actually simplified it with some new logic. So let me pull out the fuel system. So here it is in all its glory. So this is a fully functioning fuel system we have a bunch of logic but the main thing is is the accumulators these blocks are amazing it's definitely a game changer in terms of logic in this game so with this blue side here this is our main input so shift to increase the throttle left control to decrease the throttle which goes into an accumulator and with the accumulator what these allow you to do is have a gradual input so just like you have a uh, xbox controller for example with the triggers you can have have a slower input depending on how much you put into it and we also have one again on the left here which represents our fuel in this system we have about five seconds of actual fuel before it cuts off all the logic and i'll go ahead and show you that so if you keep an eye on the blue accumulator with the uh, decal of the fuel gauge on that is our variable throttle so depending on how much throttle you give will affect how much fuel is lost so this is a really kind of simplified advanced system where we couldn't do this before with pistons. But with this throttling system, you could potentially lose fuel at different paces depending on how much throttle you give into the system, which is awesome. So the green bar on the left accumulator is indicating that all the fuel is ran out. So that green bar is full. Just imagine it in an opposite way. If you go ahead and repair Soul Reaper, if you give us a tiny bit of throttle, you can see how the left accumulator is filling up, which is actually emptying. And once that is full, if you give it some more throttle, there it goes, halfway of fuel now, a quarter left, and then we are out of fuel. And that's basically the system. Really simple, but also fully functioning. We also do have this red distance sensor, which we can potentially refuel. And you can see how I've refueled my, my tank there. And then we're all good to go again. So this can work in pretty much any vehicle you want. If you wanted to have actual fuel in your vehicle, you know, you could actually refuel it with a sensor and have it only go a certain distance depending on, you know, how much fuel you used and if you've run out of fuel or not. Definitely a fun logic system. And today we've actually incorporated this into my F-18. So here is the F-18. It has been modified with the fuel system. You can see it on the back there. You can see how much throttle I put into it and how much fuel. The fuel for this particular vehicle is about two minutes of fuel at full throttle. So we have about two minutes to do our mission. And today's mission is actually going to be who can take out the most space pirates within our fuel count. Sound good, Soul Reaper? Sounds very good. Also, you may have noticed my engine actually exploded there. There is a new uh, damage physics with the engines, which means they actually can explode now, which is awesome. All right, so we have our F-18s. The fuel tanks are now ready. So we have two miniguns for this mission. But just remember, keep an eye on your fuel. This is the whole point of this exercise is how much fuel you have. And if you run out of fuel, you're going to drop out of the sky. So maybe, I guess, prepare yourself for a landing. All right, remember, Soul Reaper, we have about an average of two minutes of fuel. That's at full throttle. You got it. Okay, go ahead and give us a countdown. We'll get straight into this. Three two one go all right i'm full there we go let's go for full throttle for now so i can get these quick kills all right okay yeah all right that's one that's two ah uh, you one. took that one okay all right let's go for this one three four nice nice oh that's an island to be careful two Five. All right. Okay. Let's slow down on the throttle a bit. We don't Three. want to use too much fuel. Let's go ahead and go over to these ones. Let's go to the bridge. There are a lot of balloons there. Mm -hmm. Six. Seven. 
Four, five, six. Seven, eight. eight. Nice. Nine. There we go. Oh, you're beating me. Damn. All right. There's more balloons this way. All right. Max Ten, throttle. Eleven. Twelve. Ooh, almost hit Nine. The Where are the enemies? <laughs> Come on, here they 13. are. 13. 14. Yeah. 10. 11. 15. 12. 15. What's my I, fuel I'm, like? Uh oh. I'm over halfway on my fuel. Oh, this is a dangerous situation. Oh god. I'm I think I'm on 13. Count. I've lost count yeah. too. So we're used to recording. Alright, here we go. I'm gonna try and 16. go for these planes. Damn, I've lost count. Why won't these guys die? Come on! There's another one. Okay. Uh, Alright. Oh no, I'm about to run out of fuel. I mean, I have a bit left. I have a bit left. I can take out a few more. I'm... This is not a good use of my time, trying to shoot down a red one. There we go. That's another one. I completely forgot what number I'm on. I'm definitely going to have to check during the editing. Last thing I heard was 13. Yeah. Uh, well, how's my fuel? All right, that's another one. What's my fuel like? Whoa. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, this isn't good. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm out of fuel. No, I shouldn't have gone for that last plane. No. I'm out of fuel, soul. Oh. I'm getting there. I'm, getting, I'm almost there. I, I've, I've botched this. There we go. I'm out. Holy smokes. I'm oh. trying to conserve my last bit of fuel. All right. Let's see if you can make it with your last bit of fuel. I did not make it. Oh, that's a speeder. Oh, yeah. Landed. You landed? Well, um, I have no idea how many I have. I think I'm above 20 or something, but... Okay, you only definitely won this challenge. Um, I just could not find any enemies. So we go ahead and land. But the whole point of that uh, challenge was to show off the actual working fuel system. But it gave combat in general just that one extra thing to have to keep worry about. And that is your fuel. And I think we've displayed that perfectly today. And you could use it for uh, ammunition if you wanted to. Yeah, the same there's so many, there's so many different things you can do with this new logic now. So not just fuel, you can have a gear system for speed, throttle control, ammunition, just like Soldier said. Working ammunition is something we might actually have to to visit with this new logic, to be honest. And a whole bunch more of new possibilities with this logic. So definitely a fun concept to show off whilst we have early access to 1.9. I hope I'm getting you guys hyped for this update with the new logic and all the new additions to this game in general. And if you have any ideas on what else I can do whilst I have access to early access, definitely let me know. And whilst you're at it, why not consider subscribing? It's free. But anyway, that's enough from me and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.